come to the Rock of Dunamaze. The first mention of the rock is 120 AD. The Greek cartographer Ptolemy did a first map of Ireland and the rock is clearly marked on the map. The next time we have mention is the 9th century. The Bishop of Terryglass was hiding in the rock here and the Vikings attacked and kidnapped the, the abbot and killed him. The next time we have mentioned then is the Anglo-Norman invasion, 1169, and Dermot looked for the Anglo-Normans to come to Leinster to help him, and he promised Strongbow his daughter Aoife in marriage. When Aoife um, married Strongbow, this the Rock of Dunamaze was part of the dowry. Now their daughter Isabel was given in marriage at the age of 16 to the, um, to the knight William Marshall. He was 43 and he was marshal to five kings of England. Now they had 10 children, five girls and five boys, and the girls were married to all the royal families around Europe. And the last of the descendants of the marshals to live or to own the Rock of Dunamaze was 1350 and it was the Mortimer family. And the last Mortimer was, Robert, was Roger and he was killed for treason. After that, it went back into the hands of the Irish and the Umors. So welcome to the Inner Barbican Gate. This is the, the gate we go through today. It was the second gate and built in the early 13th century by Marshall. Both sides of me, you can see um, the walls that would have been manned by archers, soldiers. Again, remembering that everything about the castle is about defense. When we walk through the gate, you can see staggered windows that you would have had archers either side and staggered so that they don't get each other, but that they could defend easily. Postern gate, or the basically the back door in, into the Rock of Dunamate. This would have been the gate for major defence. Only one person could ever come through it at one time. So one archer, one defender could always. And you know, if you just come up here and sit at the Rock of Dunamate and take in that fabulous view that you can see, and even just bring up a picnic. You don't need to do anything else and just take in all that we can see. You can see Offaly from here, Tipperary. Obviously we can see over the Leash countryside and just relax and do nothing else. So you're welcome to the Great Hall at the top of the Rock of Dunham Maze and we've made it up the hill. So this would have been the main building and the biggest building on the site. It's where everything took place, where the family lived, where the food was cooked. Um, it, most of it was built in the 13th century and it was restored again late 18th century by an ancestor of Charles Stuart Parnell. Um, he died before the roof went on, so this is why unfortunately it fell into ruin again. If you come on side with me, we'll give you a look at what it would have looked like. So you're welcome into the hall. Beautiful views out the window here. If you do come along, get lovely pictures of the leash landscape out the window. Probably in the corner here, there would have been a fire all day with an animal, usually deer, pig, even hedgehog, swan, anything that moved, they could eat it, they cooked it. You would have had carpets or rugs on the wall for insulation, for color, for to make the place look pretty, social standing. The Lord of the house would have had all his administrative power in this building, so he would have settled any local disputes between local minor chiefs, anything going on in the community.
the gate of the Rock of Dunham Maze, we have a notice board. The thing to do, the thing that we would recommend you do is to take a photograph of this so you can have a look at it when you get home. Because you know when you're somewhere and you don't remember what you've seen and you can look back on it. There's a picture of the rock as it would have looked in the 12th to 13th century. And after you visit here, what I would recommend you do is go to Heritage House in Abbey Leaks and they have a remodel of the Rock of Dunamis in the 12th to 13th century. And you can then see what it really looks like then when Marshall had it completely built it and it was in use.